this video, we're going to be creating an OP mob grinder that's going to make us a ton of money on the server. So let's get straight into it. So I have seen the top island grinder, so I think I'm going to build one similar to it, similar to something like that. We currently can only place 24 spawners or spawner stacks. I'm not really sure how that works. But if we take a look in the island upgrades, we can up the spawner stack size. And we do also have some of the, we do also have some of these spawner stack slots that boost your, boost how much spawners you can put, which boost how much stacks of spawners you can put on your island. I am currently trying to expand my nether farm because it is kind of small and I can't continuously grind because the crops have to regrow so i want to expand this so we can keep grinding because we need to level up and get a lot more money we're almost at 100 mil right now so we can buy some spawners if we take a look in the shop we should probably start buying like some zombies or skeletons maybe or honestly the ender might is only 7.5 mil so that might be a good one i don't really know what the best one is we're gonna have to test them out and see which one makes the most money off camera i did a little bit of blaze grinding and we have 1.8 million xp we can go ahead and use on our gear currently on our armor we have no enchant so let's go ahead and see what enchants we can actually go and put on it so we could put crash crop which gives you a percentage boost chance to get an extra farming loot while farming crops that could be pretty good grinder has a chance to give you a better has a chance to give you some keys lumberjack logs i don't really need that i don't really mind the logs and then fi mind fanatic okay so these two are probably going to be the ones that we do want we are almost at level 40 and once we get to level 40 we'll be able to get the villager armor so we might want to go ahead and wait because that's only two levels away and once we do that we can get another set or a better set of the grinding armor we're currently on Scarecrow. It's just going to give us better points, probably more farming fortune and speed. And we're also going to be able to put some enchants on that. So I'm going to go ahead and grind until I do get to level 40. And I want to see the recipe for it. If it is too much, I might just put the enchants on the Scarecrow armor. But let's see. Okay, so we got to level 40. So let's go ahead and check out the recipe for the villager armor. It looks like we're going to need 48 enchanted carriage, 96 raw salmon, and 9 enchanted golden ingots. So that actually might take a while to get. So let's go ahead and enchant the Scarecrow armor for now. Actually, I want to see the boost the villager gives. It gives you speed fishing speed and fishing fortune so honestly the farming set is probably better it has farming fortune which will give us more of the nether war and stuff which will actually give us more money so let's go ahead and enchant each piece with the crash crop and the grinder because these are going to be the, be the best ones for us when we are trying to grind okay so we have fully maxed out the enchants on our armor so let's go ahead and equip it and it should be giving us a lot better boost but we did use almost all of our xp so we're gonna have to grind up some more xp later okay so i was grinding the nether world for a bit and we are going to equip this money pit and sell all the nether wart so boom all the enchanted nether wart so for 40 million definitely gonna take that and the rest honestly probably wouldn't sell for too much so we're gonna just throw those out because we wouldn't get too much from that but yeah 40 million we're at 132 million you can see nether wart are a decently good way of making money but now we do want to go ahead and start building this spawner this mob farm let's go ahead and claim both of these spawner stack slots it should boost it by three and boom now we can place 27 stack spawners okay so i finished making the grinder i think it should work we have the chunk chest down here probably expand the storage for it but we bought 32 skeleton spawners we have four pig spawners and seven sheep spawners but currently if we try to place down the skeleton spawners it says the it says we can't because we can only place spawners with a max stack size of eight we can upgrade it in ice upgrades but we currently don't have any mob coins so we're gonna have to open up some crates get some crates for those mob coins but let's go ahead and get eight of those real quick and boom if we just do that i'm pretty sure we should be able to place another one above it or a block above it like this and then place some more spawners like this every time we do this it does use a stack spawner on the right as you can see it says two two stacks out of 27 so these spawner so these spawner stack slots is actually how you increase the number of kind of stacks you have right here we definitely want to increase the stack size that we can actually put in each stack and we also should get more like stacks that we can place down in total we also want to go ahead and go into ice upgrades and get the mob spawn speed increased as soon as possible so those are all the things we need to work towards for the grinder but let's see if it is working some skeletons just died and boom here are some bones if we sell 24 of them that's 6k right there which isn't bad so if we do afk this for a little bit it should make a decent amount of money and we do have the money pet i'm gonna go ahead and expand the storage with some hoppers but if we take a look in slash ice upgrades we currently have a limit the limit is only 192 or the limit is 192 so we shouldn't even use that much for this but as we do keep making it bigger it should we should probably have to upgrade it eventually and while i'm mining for some iron if you guys take a look on the right of the screen we do have trophies and in order to get trophies you actually just place on spawners and it all goes to ice top if we take a look ice top has 2 million trophies which is kind of insane that means they have a lot of spawners they're probably getting a ton of money from them we're currently smelting all the iron that we do need for the hoppers and so let's go ahead and craft some i honestly think we probably could have just bought some from the shop i don't even know if they're craftable so okay they are so boom looks like we got about 16 hoppers which will definitely work for now we also did get some more chunk chests we have about four so we could expand it definitely in the future okay so this is what we got going so far it should be working but we do need a little bit more hoppers and chests just to expand it a little bit further so it doesn't fill up overnight or if we are afking overnight but yeah we probably 
probably will just because we really need the afk money or any money we could take for some more spawners and stuff like that and boom six more hoppers we're just gonna have this little chest thing go on for now as we do get more spawners and stuff and increase the increase the speed that the mob spawn we are definitely gonna have to increase it just so it doesn't overflow but yeah that is the mob spawner so this is definitely gonna generate us some money as we do afk grants of method war all that good stuff we're just gonna be passively getting the money from this and let's just take a look we do have some sell ones but just from this all these bones are gonna sell for 53k which is honestly really really good just for afk for a little bit and we honestly don't even have that many spawners so as we do keep getting nether wart we are just gonna get a spawner set up and just keep generating more and more money with this but i think the next thing i do want to do is expand the nether wart farm to make it a lot bigger because it's currently small and it doesn't regenerate as fast as i want it to so if we do make it a little bit bigger maybe it will regenerate uh, and so it's just automatic like i don't have to like pause in between grinding but yeah we've made so many progress in this video we got a so we got some good enchants on our armor we did get a mob spawner set up and this is going to make us some money we did get all that and we can honestly place a lot more spawner so yeah we're going to probably farm some nether wart we do need the money and also dungeons i forgot to mention dungeons are a really good way to get some points to level up and are also good for mob coins and stuff like that one thing i am lacking on is the quest so let's go to spawn and speak to slayer aaron about the quest this is also going to give us a small pet backpack which could be very very useful for quickly ascending them and just having a storage for them so we found him at spawn he's just to the right so let's go ahead and click him and see what he says quest started profitable mobs we have to talk to him in spawn so we did get a small pet backpack we could go ahead and put all their pets in there wood sword we honestly don't even need let's go ahead and just toss that out let's say we can't drop anything let's just pv it we really honestly don't need that at all kill mobs at our island so slew slash is go let's go ahead and see what the quest tells us to do so we have to kill any spawner mob at our island so let's just go over here in our new spawner this honestly works well and we've killed it so let's complete if we do slash quest let's see what the next thing it tells us to do is kill 10 spawner mobs and then the next one is to talk back to him and he will give us a tier one quest box create a points booster and a spawner slot voucher which we're definitely gonna take so i'm gonna go ahead and kill 10 of these mobs once they do spawn it shouldn't take too long and i'll just come back once i have done that and i already said i completed it uh, i guess i don't have to do it for too long let's go back to spawn and get that quest box because that is gonna help us give some good rewards and stuff okay boom the quest is complete let's go ahead and throw down the box you have to right click it to open so we got some experience some money um this money is not really gonna help we do make a lot more from our netherworld farms we got some mob coins we're definitely gonna take the mob coins we'll take any mob coins we can actually get spawner stack slot let's go ahead and claim that let's see what the next quest is speak to farmer roy at spawn and start the quest what do we get from this we get pig spawner tier one quest quest box create really create okay i'm not gonna do this here right now because it is honestly very very easy and the rewards aren't anything too crazy but i do want to get our quest started because as you can see let's see what quest we can do we're at level 40 right now and 40 will give us chunk chest spawner slot vouchers quest quest box create so yeah we just want to keep doing our quest as we do keep leveling up just to keep up with all of them but i'm gonna go ahead and put all of our pets into the pet backpack we have all of these we have two unique xp pets so once we get another one we can go ahead and combine it to the next rarity and we also have an epic plus money pet i kind of want a better one just for the better boost but if we take a look put all of them in here we could have just done deposit all but look you can delete the common pets uh because you can't upgrade your common pets common pets and combine them we can do ascend all but they're already all ascended in yeah it's just way better you can sort them and all that stuff so it's a oh, way better thing to have and also when you guys are grinding nether war i do recommend to go into the mob coin shop and actually buy an auto condensed voucher because this is going to auto condense all the nether wart for 45 minutes and that's really good because look how fast my inventory fills up with this like it's already almost full after grinding for like five seconds so it does save you a lot of time from having to slash sell all, all the time well that's going to be it for today i hope you guys enjoyed if you did leave a like and subscribe and i'll see you in the next one peace out